life on Earth is powered by the sun. The closest star to our planet. Its life-giving rays take just eight minutes to reach us. Striking the Earth head-on at the equator, it's here that they deliver the most intense solar energy on the planet, enabling life to flourish. Thanks to its location just south of the equator, the Serengeti sun rises high in the sky throughout the year, delivering 12 hours of intense solar energy every day. With few trees to shade the ground, the animals here have learned to deal with the blistering heat of the dry season. Some have resorted to rather extreme measures. The marabou stork has one of the strangest cooling systems in the Serengeti. This peculiar bird defecates on its own legs, turning them white. And as the droppings evaporate in the hot sun, it cools the bird in much the same way as our sweat. But as the sun's heat turns the grasslands to tinder, life on the savannah is about to change. One spark is all it takes. A fire is born. Whipped by the wind, it rages across the sun-baked land consuming over half of the Serengeti every year. Animals large and small race to escape the flames. But for the marabou stalks, the fire brings food. Each fleeing insect a protein-rich snack. They flock to the burning grasses from miles around to feast amidst the chaos. As the fire starts to retreat, others brave the heat, patrolling the front line for easy pickings. Eventually, the fuel runs out and the flames die. The savannah, a scorched and blackened land. But the grasses here have evolved with fire storing their resources safely below ground in starch-rich roots. And the rainy season brings all the moisture they need to flourish. Ripened by the constant sun and fertilized by ash, the savanna grows anew. Some grasses gaining up to three centimeters in just 24 hours. Once again, the fire brings feast. This surge of life from the ashes feeds the next generation. The new shoots are rich in essential minerals for nursing mums. And plenty of grass means plenty of milk. In just three weeks, half a million wildebeest calves are born in the Serengeti. Unlike the devastating forest fires in the Amazon rainforest, grass fires have been a natural process here for hundreds of millions of years. Driven by the sun, this cycle of renewal supports the greatest herds on the planet. Without it, these rich savannas and the incredible life within them would likely disappear.